Hey, what's up, everyone? It's Maddox, Fire Nice Cakes here, and today I'm going to show you my full sneaker collection. Um, my room doesn't look a lot different. Um, this is my sneaker wall, I guess you could say. I got a panel here, got one here, and I got one connected right here. Um, this is a custom-built sneaker wall, so it's really cool to me. Um, this is almost like a dream come true, because I've always wanted to have like a huge sneaker display. Um, no one else has this, which is really cool. Um... So yeah, I'm going to get into my first shoe. Um, I have to make this a bit shorter because I've made probably five of these. And every t everyone's been a more than 15 minutes long, and that's how much my phone can process. So I'll just get straight to it. First shoe is a Damian Lillard 2s. Very nice shoe. I play basketball in these. These are, if I play basketball, like an actual game, these are the shoes I play in. They're really comfortable. Yeah, so yeah, there's that. We got my first shoe with a shoe tree in it. I feel special now. But this are the these are the um, Hypercross Nike trainers, which are the AJ Green PEs. He's a wide receiver for the Bengals, probably one of the best in the league. So yeah, here's that one. Here are my probably my favorite curries I have. Um, these are the Northern Lights. These retail for one thirty, and right now, like on eBay, they go for about five hundred, four hundred dollars. So it's actually really cool. And that's the what, last time I checked on eBay. It's been about a month since I checked, so they might have gone down, they might have gone up. So I don't know. So yeah, these are the Northern Lights sandals. Here we have the birthday surprises of the Curry Twos as well. Nice shoe. Here we got a trophy room bag. Um, yeah, I live in Florida, so Michael Jordan's son has a store, trophy room, it's a sneaker boutique, it's really nice, I like it a lot. Got two keychains, we got the cool gray fives, and like the same badge they call away of the 11s. Here we have a Nike Field General, the Florida State University shoe. These are, that's my favorite college, I want to go to Florida State, um, yep, so there's that. Here's my brightest shoe in my collection, um, the the Vault, or the Vault um, Jordan Futures. And I love the shoe because they have the 11 bottom, and they have like just like the carbon fiber in the midsole. That's that's why they got them. On. That's the yeah. I can't speak. I'm getting really sick. This is the inspiration from the 11s, so it's really cool. I like these a lot. The 11s, in my opinion, is the greatest shoe of all time. I love them so much. Um, here's one of my bulkiest, but one of my favorite grails, one of my grails. These are the first ballot questions from Reebok. These are Allen Iverson shoes. Um, very nice shoes. Got suede on the back. Red toe box, leather. Um, I'm so glad I have these shoes. They have a white bottom, so they're dirty really easily, but I can clean them off in like a second. So yeah, there's these. Here we have the Kobe 9 Highs um, Elites through the Mama Days. Um, probably my favorite thing is the gold stripe right here and how they have old Flywire Upper, I mean Flynet. So yeah, these are a great shoe. Probably one of my favorite basketball shoes of all time. Up here we have the Kobe Phenomenon 4s. Um, I got these at Ross. It was a steal for there, I think they were 40 bucks. And these retail for 110 so these were a really pretty good pickup. Um, I, I've beaten these a lot. I've only had them for about two months now. And I'll probably do a cleaning video or something on these, I don't know. Okay, so right here I have one of my most limited shoes. These are the Bradley Beal PEs for the Hyper of 2016s. Um, these are an exclusive shoe to a, um, a sneaker bar in Houston. And the coordinates are actually on the shoe, which is really cool. Um, yeah, so I like these a lot. Uh, probably one of my most limited shoes. Um, yeah, good basketball shoe as well. Okay, that's what they're meant for. Um, here we have my favorite shoes of all time. I will always have these until the day I pass away. These are the Cherry 11 Lows. Um, these are Jordan Retro. Old pant leather on here. Like a milky outsole so yeah my favorite shoe always will be my favorite shoe love these a lot 
And if my voice down so sounds weird, um, I have a really bad bluish slash cold. So yeah, these are the Kobe 10 EXTs with the gold tips right here and a gold Kobe sign. Um, yeah, these are very nice. I don't know if I'm going to keep these or sell these because they just hurt my feet so bad. But at the same time, I want to keep them because I love Kobe's. So yeah, here's these. KD8 um, N7s. These are for the Native Americans. It's a whole sneaker line. There's many different sneakers that introduce the N7 to them. So that's a very cool shoe. I have destroyed these, which I wish I didn't. Because um, I love KD's. I wish I didn't do this to the shoe. Um... I got chocolate all over them once by certain someone that I'm not going to say, but yeah, there's that. Um, Kyrie ones, um, cool colorway, got these for seals well for like 80 bucks I believe, at a Nike outlet for clearance, these are really cool pickup. These are a model that resembles the Jordan 11s. These are because of the Futures as well. They're Lowe's. Um, same as the sole, midsole. Very cool shoe. Um, bit of a bright shoe, but I like it. Another one with the shoe tree in them. Um, Kobe 1 Mentalities. I think these are nicer than the second one. Because just so the sole is a lot nicer. The insole is different. It's a very lightweight shoe. Um, these are the Alphas. So yeah, these are really nice. I got these for Super Steel, 20 bucks. Got them half off, plus 25% as well. Here I have the Kobe 9 Lows, the Medievals. Very cool shoe. They're like a different type of material. And like weather stuff right here. So yeah, it's pretty cool. LeBron 13, Akronites. Yeah, it's a vacuum in the background. I'm sorry. <laughs> but yeah, here's these. LeBron 12, 4th of July editions. Um, I beat these a lot. I've gotten them repainted. The person did an awful job, which I probably could have done better. That was when I wasn't in the cleaning shoes. Now I'm at a whole sneaker business. Fire nice kicks. Um, yeah, shout out to myself. Um, I have a... <laughs> shout out, Bri. I have a uh, sneaker um, page on Instagram. So yeah, follow me on there. But yeah, that's... Your... If you want to hit me up, that's nebblematics at yahoo.com. Um, I clean shoes for five bucks, so yeah. And right here, I got the KD. These are another limited shoe. These are the KD, five tra KD Tray 5s. Um... These are limit. These are the limited edition ones. These are cool pick up. I like these a lot. I got these as an early Christmas gift because they were nine and a half, and I'm eleven now. Ugh, and my dad got them for me for this Christmas. I didn't realize how small he got them, so he just gave them to me. So yeah, there's these. Katie Southern, Katie Seven Weathermans. Um, I made a really bad decision, and just beat the crap out of them. I wore them all the time. Like this, I have awful heel drag on the sole. These things I could probably throw away, but I'm not going to because I like them a lot. Um, right here, you like tearing. And the only thing I don't like about these KDs is like the model's a little weird. But yeah, I probably sh I probably should have waited on them because I got them for retail, like just when they came out for two hundred bucks. And I bought these Roshi One Camo Pack. Um, beat the crap out of these as well. I got these at the exact same time. So yeah. With all my Christmas money, so I spent like three hundred bucks on these two shoes, which at which at the time I was into like the with like this kind of stuff, like the LeBrons and all them. But I'm trying to work my way to all the, getting all the um, uh, retros for Jordan. These are the Cam. These are not made anymore, actually. These are the Cam Newton. These are his shoes. Pretty cool. I have two pairs of them. Here's my favorite pair. The blue ones. These are smaller. I had these a little while ago, but I still like them. Yeah, there's those. Some Jordans. Nothing special. Those are for sale. Um, 
some Flynet 4.0s. Um, I like these a lot, the Flynet free runs. I uh, I wear these pretty much every day. Like these, these are a great shoe. I'd rather actually rather have those in Ultra Boosts. Here are some flight posits. Um, I got these for Christmas. These are for sale as well. Pretty much my whole wall right here is for sale. So yeah, there's these. Basketball shoes, Nike. Hyper Dunks, these are for sale. These are near dead stock, worn once. Yeah. So if anyone hit me up, 40 bucks. Pair of nine and a half, I believe. Size nine, Hyper Dunks. The green glows. She got me into this. These are probably being thrown away, or these are gonna be for sale as well. So, are you doing a video? Yeah. Um, yeah. So these are the Air Max. <laughs> these are the the Carmelos, um, Jordans. These are worn a few times. These are for sale as well. They have like a whole new buck right here. It's pretty nice. Fly wire, everything like that. Yeah, and that was my mom with this and so that probably ruined the video, but I'm going to still do it, because it's like the seventh time, so I'm just like, screw it. I'm just going to post this one. Um, Nike, Nike LeBron Soldier. Chips were me off on those. They gave me a say, size 8 and a size 9 out of the two. Um, these are about Nike Hyper Dunk. I mean, Hyper Dunks. The um, Dunk Premium Lows. These are like the Candy Cane Special. I'm just came in again. Um, these are the the Derrick Rose twos, the South Sides. I like these a lot. These are cool. Those are for sale as well. And then last shoe, I believe, um, out of the ones on my wall, are the CP threes, CP three fours or fives. Probably not the greatest Jordan in the world. Cool shoe to ball in. They have like a weird heel tab in the back. They can put down everything. But yeah, those are these. So that is the end of my sneaker collection. I have one more thing actually to show you. Um, when I went to Truth Room once, I actually met Michael Jordan and his son. Well, Michael Jordan's son signed this. He I actually know him now. I've met him a few times. So that's pretty cool. So yeah, that is my sneaker collection. Um, hopefully I got it under the time. So yeah, thank you very much. And Fire Nice Kicks is out. Bye.